Hey, Mary Ellen. Happy Friday. Hey, Mike. Hello, Hayes family. Yes. Definitely TGIF. Hey, Christina. Hi, Janice, Sarah, and Dee. All right, we'll get started in about a minute. For those who are new, um, we're gonna be doing, hey, Bill, we're gonna be doing a couple exercises where you need some hand weights. So um, if you have hand weights, awesome. If not, hey, Gigi, hey, Chris, uh, you can use water bottles that have water in them of course or uh, cans of vegetables so we'll be using those later hey Ryan happy Friday hey Emily happy almost Easter all right Let's go ahead and start um, our warm up. So uh, just make sure that for our warm up, we have enough room. So when we put our arms out, we don't hit anything, okay? So let's start with warming up our arms. We're gonna do some arm circles. So put your arms straight out and start by moving them in little circles. Just like that. And then you're gonna make some bigger circles. And then you're gonna make nice big windmills with your arms, both of them at the same time. And then we're gonna go one at a time. Pretend that we're swimming. Hey, Coach Joan. Good job, shake those arms out. Now we're gonna go the other way. So I'm gonna go backwards, starting with small circles. Hey, Caitlin. All right, a little bit bigger. Happy Friday, everybody. Hope you had an awesome day. Now let's make some big circles with our arms. Great job. Let's go one at a time. We get those shoulders warmed up. Awesome. All right, shake those arms out. Now we're gonna do some uh, trunk twists. So we're gonna twist side to side. Keep those feet stuck on the ground. Great job. All right, shake it out. 
Now we're gonna do some Frankensteins. So to do that, we're gonna put our arms straight out in front of us and keeping our legs straight, we're gonna kick them out one at a time so that we look like walking zombies. Hey Coach Joan, I have my Pawtucket Pacers purple on today. My pants are purple, I don't know if you can tell. Great job. We're gonna add another warm-up exercise um, from one of our Special Olympics Rhode Island athletes, Christina, wanted to do some butt kicks. So um, after our Frankensteins, we're gonna work on our butt kicks. So to do that, we're just gonna kick our feet back one at a time like we're kicking our butt. Hey Andy. Awesome job guys. Great. So now our last warm up exercise we're going to be doing some um, calf raises. So to do that, we're going to be going up on our tippy toes and back down. Great job. Awesome job. Shake it out. Go ahead and grab some water. Thank you um, to everybody who joined me on this Friday. Happy Friday. I'm really happy to be here with you guys. We have some new faces. I've seen uh, Cyan, uh, Lauren, thank you all for joining. Uh, we're gonna get a great workout in tonight. This is gonna be our last day of doing all level two exercises. Next week, I'm gonna start bringing in some level three exercises. So you guys have been doing awesome. We're just gonna keep working up gradually as we get stronger and stronger each session. So again, this is all exercises from the Fit5 guide from Special Olympics. And I will be leading these exercises for you uh, and also giving you alternative exercises if um, you need an, some sort of adaptation uh, or to make an exercise easier or harder. So first we're gonna be working on endurance and all of these exercises are working to strengthen our heart and our lungs make us um, run faster, swim faster, uh, and exercise for longer periods of time without having to take a lot of breaks, which we definitely want um, to be able to do. So I'm gonna go over these exercises with you, and then we're gonna do a circuit. We're gonna rotate through the circuit three times. So the first exercise that we're gonna do is the side-to-side -side hop and to do that, we're gonna imagine that there's a line down the middle of our uh, room and our feet are gonna be shoulder width apart and we're gonna jump over that line and then we're gonna reset and go back over. Just like that. You can also, if you don't have room side to side, you can jump forward and back. So you can go forward and then back. And then you can also jump in place. And then um, for those who can't jump wherever they are, uh, you can step side to side like this or whatever speed is good for you. Just like that. If uh, our friends who are in wheelchairs, 
if you want to work on getting those legs up, moving those legs, you can move them straight up, you can move them out. Whatever um, works for you. So that's our first exercise. The second exercise we're going to do is jogging in place. And our goal with this is we want to move both of our arms and our legs at the same time. So whatever pace is best for you, it can look like this. Or you can move your legs a little bit faster. Or you can be kind of walking in place. As long as you're moving both your arms and your legs, that's what we want. To make it a little bit harder, in addition to moving your feet faster, you can also lift your knees higher like that. Okay, and then again, our friends in wheelchairs can be focusing on getting those knees up in their chairs. And then the last exercise we're gonna do in the circuit is the step up. So you don't necessarily need a chair, uh, uh, need a chair, need a step. I'm gonna use these steps here, uh, but you can also use one of these like workout steps or you can high knee march in place. So what you're gonna do is you're going to step up with both feet and then step down and then go back up and down just like that. If you want to make it a little bit harder, you can step up and then bring your second knee up and then go back down just like that. I'm imagining there's a step here. Or um, you can just, if you don't have a step, you can high knee march in place. Use both your arms and your legs at the same time just like that. All right, so those are our three exercises uh, for endurance, and we're gonna go through that circuit three times, okay? I'll keep track of the clock. You just focus on pacing yourself through these exercises. We're gonna be trying to do them uh, for 45 seconds each, so I know you can do it. Um, just keep focused and stay positive i'm cheering you on all right let's go ahead and get ready so again our first exercise is going to be uh jumping the side to side hop so let's go ahead and get ready all right three two one Go. Awesome job, guys. Over halfway there, you can do it. Keep pushing. Three, two, one, and rest. All right, nice job. Thank you for everybody who has joined us. I want to shout out to the names I see here, Caitlin, Casey, Mikey, Rhonda, Tracy, Erica. Happy Friday. And get our sweat on. Next exercise we're doing. Um, oh geez, I need a reminder here. What am I doing? Jogging in place. We're gonna go in about 10 seconds. All 
All right, ready? Three, two, one, go. Move both those arms and those legs together. Great job, everybody. Doing awesome. Keep at it, keep at it. Here we go. Three, two, one, and rest. Nice job. We're going to do the step ups next. So wherever you have a set of stairs or you have an exercise step um, or you can just do high knee marching in place any of those things will work I'm going to use these stairs here While we're resting, let's take some deep breaths together. We're going to take a deep breath in and let it out. Deep breath in and let it out. One more deep breath in and let it out. Good job. All right, we're going to go in about 10 seconds. So go ahead and get to uh, wherever you're going to do the step ups. All right, ready? We're gonna go in three, two, one, now. Awesome job, guys. Ten more seconds. Three, two, one, and rest. Nice job. Let's take um, a quick water break. So we have one set done. We have two sets to go. Let's take some deep breaths together. Let's take a deep breath in and let it out. And deep breath in and let it out. One more deep breath in and let it out. All right. Awesome job, everybody. Hey, Kathy. Yeah, so I think next week I'll start looking at the level three exercises and seeing what we can add in. So we've been doing level two for a bit now. Try to add some new exercises in there for you. Next, we're gonna be going back to our side to side hops. We'll go in about 10 seconds. All right, ready? Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Great 
Great job. Almost there. Keep jumping, you can do it. Three, two, one, and rest. Nice job, let's take some deep breaths. In, and let it out. And deep breath in, and let it out. One more breath in, and let it out. Great job. Next, we're going to do our jogging in place. All right, we're gonna go in about 10 seconds, so go ahead and get into position for our jogging. All right, ready? Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Move both those arms and those legs. Great job. Ten more seconds. You can do it. Three, two, one, and rest. Great job. Go ahead and grab a quick sip. Hey, Cyan. I miss seeing you at dance class. Okay, our next exercise, we're gonna be doing step ups. So I'm gonna use these stairs here. Remember, you can use stairs, you can use the exercise step, or you can just march in place. Okay, we're gonna go in about 10 seconds, so go ahead and get into position. All right, ready? Three, two, one, go. Awesome job, almost there. Three, two, one, and rest. Great job, everybody. Go ahead and grab your water. Let's take some deep breaths together. Take a deep breath in and let it out. And deep breath in and let it out. One more deep breath in and let it out. All right, two sets down, one set to go. You guys are doing awesome.
All right, so you know what's next. We have our side to side hops. Last time we're going through. We're going about 10 seconds. All right, really focus, you can do it. Here we go, three, two, one, go. Awesome job, everybody. Doing great, almost done. Three, two, one, and rest. Great job. Next exercise will be jogging in place. Take three deep breaths together. Take a deep breath in and out. Deep breath in and out. One more in and out. Great job. Go ahead. Let's get into position for jogging in place. We're gonna go in about 10 seconds. You guys are doing awesome. Last time we're doing jogging in place. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Let's see those arms and those legs moving. Is that Coach Rick that joined? No, it's Ron. Ron LaBresh. Hey Ron, hey Lizzie. Awesome job, guys. Almost there, 10 more seconds. Three, two, one, and relax. Great job. Okay, we only have one more thing to do for our endurance set, that's awesome. We're just gonna do our step ups. All right, we'll go in about 10 seconds, so go ahead and get into position. Here we go. Three, two, one, go. Great job, guys. more seconds. Three, two, one, and rest. Awesome job. It's a high five for you. Go ahead and grab some water. And I'm gonna show you our strength exercises. So we're gonna work on 
getting those muscles nice and strong. So our first exercise is going to be the squat. So for the squat, you're going to use a chair to help you. All right, so we have this chair here helping me. My feet are a little bit wider than shoulder width apart. And I'm going to be sitting my butt back like I want to sit in the chair, but I'm not going to sit down. As soon as my butt hits the seat of the chair, I'm going to come back up and come right back up. Okay? Easy peasy. For my friends that might need a little bit more um, assistance with balance, you can use the back of a chair or the back of your couch. Hold on to it. Again, those feet are nice and wide. And we're gonna focus on sitting our butt back and bending our legs. And go as far down as is comfortable for you. Okay? And then for our friends who are in wheelchairs, you can do this sitting down as well. You want to focus on strengthening those hip flexors, which are right in the front. And we're going to try to lift both of our legs up off of the seat of that chair at the same time. So that's strengthening our hip flexors and our abs. So that's the first exercise. The second one we're going to do are shrugs. So for this, you either need uh, hand weights or you can use some cans of vegetables or you can use full water bottles, whatever you have on hand. And you're gonna have, your arms are gonna be relaxed at your sides and you're just gonna shrug your shoulders up and come back down. Just like that. All right, so that's the shrug. And then the third one we're gonna do is also arms. It's gonna be the overhead press. So to do that, we're going to, the starting position will be with our weights right here. And then we're gonna push straight up and then come back down. Just like that. All right. Oops. Knocked over my water bottle. So we are going to do this circuit three times. And today, just like Wednesday, we're going to do 12 of each. And I want to hear you count nice and loud. I want to hear you through the screen all the way here in my living room, all right? So let's go get into place for our squats. All right. You ready? Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Great job. Go ahead and grab your cans 
or your weights. And we're gonna do our shrugs. All right, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, and 12. Great job. Stay right there. Bring your weights up. And we're gonna do overhead press. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, and 12. Great job, put those weights down. Hey Liz. Let's take some deep breaths together. Take a deep breath in and let it out. And take a deep breath in and let it out. One more deep breath in and let it out. Awesome. So one set done, two sets to go. We'll go back to our squats. We're gonna go in about 10 seconds, so go ahead and get into position. All right, ready? Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Awesome. Let's go ahead and grab our weights. We're gonna do shrugs next. Ready? Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten. 11 and 12. Great. Bring those weights up. I want to do overhead press. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, and 12. Great. Awesome job, everybody. So we have two sets done, one set to go. Let's take some deep breaths. Deep breath in and let it out. And deep breath in and let it out. And deep breath in and let it out. Great job. Go ahead and grab a quick sip of water. Hey, Chris. Hey, Becky. Hey, Emma. Hi, Alex. I miss you. I miss seeing you at Walking Club. So we have one more set 
of our strength exercises. You guys are doing awesome. We're gonna go in about 10 seconds. Remember we're doing our squats. We're going up to 12. Count nice and loud, all right? Here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, eleven, and twelve. Great job. Go ahead and grab those weights. All right, we're gonna do our shrugs. Ready, here we go. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, and 12. Great job. Bring those weights up. Almost done. Overhead press. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, 10, 11, and 12. Great job, everybody. High five. We are almost done with strength. We have one more strength exercise. It is going to be the plank. So for this one, we need um, a soft surface. So I have a carpet. Um, as long as you are on a carpet or a rug or a mat or a towel, something soft, so you don't hurt your knees. We're going to be on our knees and we're gonna go into what looks like a push-up position. So our arms are gonna be extended, holding up our weight and we wanna keep our bellies nice and tight. So it's gonna look like this when we're in plank position. Bum is down, belly's tight, arms are strong. And we're gonna stay just like this, okay? So I'll give you a few seconds to get into position. All right, we're gonna hold these for 45 seconds. We'll work those abs. All right, here we go. Three, two, one, and plank. Keep that focus. belly's going to be burning, your arms are going to be burning, but this is your chance to stay mentally tough. You're doing great, only 10 more seconds. Keep that focus. Three, two, one, and rest. Bring that butt back. You can go into child's pose. All 
Awesome job. We'll go through two more times. All right, 10 second warning. Go ahead and get ready. You guys are doing awesome. Three, two, one, point. Focused, you can do it. Almost there. Ten more seconds. Woohoo, you're doing awesome. Three, two, one, and rest. Go back, stretch out. Great job, everybody. We have one more plank that we're gonna do. You can do it. Feel that burn. We're gonna have six pack abs. All right, 10 second warning, let's go down. Almost there. Ten more seconds. Three, two, one, and rest. Stretch it out. Awesome job, guys. High fives. All right, let's get some stretching in. So for these stretches, two of them we're gonna be down on the floor again. So the first stretch we're gonna do is the quad stretch. So it's gonna look like this. We are going to be laying on the ground and our bottom leg is going to be nice and straight and we're going to grab our foot uh, with our hand and we're going to pull back until we feel a stretch here in the front of our leg. If you're having a tough time reaching your foot, you can put a towel around and pull it back whatever is easier for you. So just find that nice stretch and hold it there. Focus on your breathing.
Awesome job. Let's switch sides. Keep that lower leg straight. And pull that top leg back till you feel the stretch and hold it. Nice job. Take some deep breaths. Awesome. All right. You can stay right there on the floor. Our next stretch is going to be the hurdler stretch. So for this one, you're going to be sitting and you're going to have one leg straight out in front of you and the other leg is going to be bent and you're going to reach forward with both of your hands towards your foot until you feel the stretch underneath your leg. And you're just going to hold that there. Focus on your breathing. Awesome job. Let's switch sides. Extend that one leg, bend the other. Take both of our hands, reach forward. Hold that stretch. Nice deep breaths. Okay, our last stretch that we're going to do is the chest stretch. So for this one, we need a wall. And you're going to have your arm up at 90 degrees. And you're going to have your arm up and then you're going to be looking the opposite way just to feel the stretch right across the top of your, across your chest. And you're just gonna hold that. job. We're going to switch sides now. Keep that arm up and you're going to look the opposite way. Feel that stretch right across the front. You guys did awesome today.
right. So awesome job, everybody. Thank you for joining me. Again, happy Friday. Um, I hope you all have a great weekend. Happy um, Easter for those who celebrate. And don't forget to send in your selfies. You've been doing so awesome uh, with sending those in. I'm, it makes me so happy to see all of your smiling faces. So definitely keep doing that. You'll be featured on our page and uh, you'll also be able to get a prize, uh, a health related prize at the end of our virtual time. So definitely keep sending those in. And again, great job. Uh, have an awesome weekend and I will see you on Monday. Bye guys.